Well, hello there and Buana Yesu Asifiwe. We are so glad to be inviting you and welcoming you here on this Spirit Night, also known as the Ibada for this month. We are so thrilled to be inviting you. We've had an amazing Harvest Conference Week and tonight we want to just wrap it all up. We want to say welcome to the month of October in this year of Restoration and Demonstration 2020. My name is Brian Mashigadi. We are coming to you right from Deliverance Church International Kasarani in Zimmerman, also known as DCIKZ. Three things as usual. Number one, please copy this link and share it with as many people as you can. Let them know that we're about to get into the presence of God in worship, in song, in adoration. I want you to um, reach out to the number that's going to be on your screen if you'd like to talk to a pastor, to pray with someone, to give your life to Jesus. If you'd like, if you have some prayer requests, reach out to that number and let us know how we may pray or minister to you. And then there's going to be details scrolling at the bottom of the screen. Please keep your eyes peeled on that. They will be letting you know how you can partner with us in this season. And to remind you of the words of the book of Isaiah chapter 65 in verse 24 when, when the Lord is talking about the future and he's saying that, listen, that while they are yet uh, talking or speaking, I will answer them. Even before they pray, I will answer them. While they are yet talking, I will already run into their, uh, into their rescue. And so that is what we want to believe today. That even before we purpose to come and join and do this thing, the Lord had begun already to release that which concerns you. He's moving in your favor. We want to believe and trust that God is doing a new thing in this season in the name of Jesus Christ. We invite you to pray with us that we may get started in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for your love and for your kindness. Thank you because you're here and thank you because no one is like you. We ask that precious King, in the short time that we're going to be here, that you will allow us to have just a glimpse of heaven and that for long after that we'll continue lifting up the precious name of Jesus Christ. Cause us, dear God, to be more like you in this place. Open our eyes, O oh God, and cause us to experience the light of your life, O oh God, in this place because we call to you and we look to you. We thank you for the assurance that you'll never leave us or forsake us. You're always with us and this is the realization and the confidence we have as we sing and worship today that you are with us with us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Welcome. All right, put your hands together. Put your hands together wherever you are. If you can, put a slight dance on your feet. Want to proclaim that He is with us. Hallelujah. Utukufu wako Utukufu wa Uwezo wako Uwezo wa Oh, ufame wako Oh, ni wa milele Oh, zako Oh, na wema wako E fadhili, fadhili zako Protecting me yes. through your power, I am mighty against all weapons formed against me. I shall not fear, I shall not fear. Yes. Mogo pena ni na e mungu akona mi akona mi akona mi akona mi akona mi akona mi sita ogo pa all right put your hands together put your hands together we'll say it one more time. Utukufu wako Utukufu wako Uwezo wako Uwezo wako Oh, ufame wako Ufame wako Ni wa milele Sema na kufu Sena wema wako Oh, fadhili, fadhili zaako Yeah. 
protecting me shall not be you Jesus all over the world there is none else to be worshipped but you O King nobody like you nobody like you nobody like you Lord yeah waku abudiwa waku pewa sifa ni wewe Na utu kufu ni wewe mungu ha. Mungu mwenye nguvu Wasta hili heshima zote Hakuna mwingine Wakulinga nishwa na wewe Mungu waku wabudiwa Wewe, 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 
wastahili wastahili heshima sote hakuna mwingine Shwana 
I don't know whether this is the same prayer that you shared together with us this day. Do you lift up your hands and for just a moment ask the Lord that I may decrease and that you may increase. That you may take me into deeper depths with you. 
that you may take me from the shore and take me deeper together with you, deeper than I've ever been before, deeper than these feet could ever think to wander by themselves, deeper than this heart could think is comfortable for it, deeper than this flesh would desire, deeper than my mental real estate could ever comprehend. Take me deeper. Lord Jesus, this is our prayer today. As we focus our eyes on you, Lord Jesus, take us deeper with you. Yes, Lord Jesus, you can have our hearts. Take us deeper with you. Deeper with you, Lord Jesus. Deeper with you.
come and consume every room yes it all belongs to you it all belongs to you come and consume every room it all
at the end of a long week, we come back to say this one thing. And when your spirit speaks to us, with all our hearts, we will agree. Our answer will always forever be yes to you. Yes to your will. Yes to your way. Yes to your plan. Yes to your call. Yes to your picture for us. Yes to the waiting. Yes to the action. Yes to the here and now. And yes to the by and by. We say yes to your invitation of life. We say yes to eternity together with you, Jesus. We say yes to keeping our eyes on you. Yes, O oh Lord, yes to you. Thank you for every word that has come forth this week. We say yes in agreement to everything you have said about us. Lord, we know we cannot do this alone. After this charge, Lord, we require help. We need you, Holy Spirit of God. Come right in and teach us to say no to ungodliness. Teach us to say no to wandering eyes. Teach us, Lord, to say no to everything that is not you. Teach us to fix our eyes on you, Lord Jesus, the author, finisher, and perfecter of our faith. We thank you for an amazing time in your presence. And we thank you because it will not stop here and now. This shall ripple into eternity for all our days on earth and forever together with you. We thank you, O oh God, for every victory. We thank you for every person that desires to receive you. As they open up their hearts, Lord, I pray that you'd find a lodging place inside of them. And I pray that, dear God, their harvest shall bring praise and glory to you, shall bring fame to the kingdom, and shall bring shame to the enemy. Because we pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Will the Lord bless you and keep you. Thank you so much for joining us. We say that's a wrap for Harvest Conference 2020. The Lord bless you and keep your eyes on him in Jesus' name. Amen.